guys! So I am back once again. This is only a couple weeks late, but at least it's going up. Um, I'm back with my July... July? July favorites. Um, I actually have quite a few. Um, I even have some hair things, which I rarely have hair things because I usually just keep the same things over and over again. But I have some hair things for you guys, and I'm just going to get started because I don't know what else to say. My first favorite is something I've actually talked about before, I know I have, and it is the Dove Hair Therapy Refresh and Care Volume Dry Shampoo. This is an empty bottle because I've used it all. It smells really good. Um, but I had a class this summer, and you know I don't like washing my hair, ever, and the class is an 8 a.m. class. So, um, this was my best friend all summer. Um, yeah, I actually need a new one because I just started classes today and I need some more dry shampoo for my hair. So, favorite. I'm just going to throw things over there. So another hair favorite um, is actually, I, I haven't tried out this kind, but um, I absolutely love Tresemme. I used it for years and years and years. Um, I, am, I learned that you should switch out your shampoo. So I've started using different things, but I've always gone back to Tresemme. And actually this one is the Tresemme 24 hour body healthy volume prep for all day body. That was a weird thing. Um, but it is the shampoo and I have the conditioner. I have the jumbo conditioner because I have a lot of hair and I use a lot of it. So you can clearly see it's like down there. But these together are great. I actually washed my hair twice with shampoo, like it tells you, but I use this for the first one to get all of the buildup from my dry shampoo out of my roots. And then I use um, another product. It's L'Oreal Paris shampoo. It's the blonde, blonde brass banisher stuff for my blonde hair to be bright and not orange. So yeah, I use that. Um, along with these and it's just my hair is so soft I don't know what it is but once I started using this my hair has just been soft for days it usually is never soft for days especially um, once I like style it and stuff it's usually like kind of crunchy and kind of like frizzy and broken but these have helped my hair so much. love these these need to go back in my shower so now I'm going to move on to makeup um, I actually have quite a few things not really. I have four things. I don't know if so I said quite a few. Usually my favorite looks this of like one makeup thing, but I have four now. So first one is this NYX Illuminator. I don't know how to say this name. It's IBBO2. I don't know if that means anything. Um, chaotic. I think it says chaotic, but it's the pink one. Um, I don't know why it's like that. It's like, do you see the texture in there? I don't know. But it is the pink one. I actually use this for a body highlight. Um, when I went to the Selena Gomez concert, I had a big fluffy brush. I kind of just did on my arms and my chest everywhere. But it is a nice little highlight. I also put it underneath my Becca highlighter on my face. I have it on today, but it's been, been like a long day. So you probably can't see it. But I do wear this underneath my Becca highlighter. Um, and I actually did an eyeshadow look with this. It was just like this, a little bit around the crease, and it was great. So that is, excuse those, that is the illuminator right there. You can clearly see it's very pink, but if you use a light hand with it and a little bit of product, um, it does make a nice little glow. So my next favorite is a blush, and you know I never stray from my Wet n Wild color icon rose a champagne however you say it but I did get a new one and this is the wet n wild color icon apricot in the middle and I actually saw who was it Buster Lux um Katie use it on her video and her skin tone is way deeper than mine so I thought this is not gonna be good for me but I got it and tried it out and it's just it's so pretty it's just a nice little apricot color and it's just really nice and pretty for soft natural days when you don't really have foundation on you just want to add a little bit of color to make your um have sun kissed skin and stuff it's just so pretty you can clearly see that one's pink and that one's apricot um it's just it's so pretty and i really love this i had it on today and i topped my rose champagne on top but you 
it's still on there, right? Yeah. I love this. It's a great product. So my next one I actually have had for this is probably a good five year product. Um, I probably should get rid of it, but I kind of just love it. And again, the label has completely wiped off, but this is the Color, Gr Color Girl, Cover Girl, they're so little, flamed out um, eyeshadow pencil. And um, this one's Ice Fire, Ice Flame, whatever. As you see, when I sharpen it, it kind of just comes out. But um, it still works. Um, I use, love doing a winged eyeliner with my NYC liquid liner, and, and then I put this one on top, kind of like a black, and then the blue, and just looks really great. That is the color right there. Uh, I, I don't know, I just, I love this, I want to get the pink one, and the champagne one, and all the other ones. Um, yeah, so I actually had this stored in my makeup stuff for a while. Um, I know I used it two years ago when I was at school uh, and I just recently got it out again and I love it. So my last favorite is a newer product. It's not something I've had around for months or years um, and it's, it's a really good one. This one's the Essence Make Me Brow Eyebrow Gel Mascara. So my first thing is going to be like the Benefit Gimme Brow. It has a very small tip for you guys. And it kind of, it, it kind of is like a powder. It's a, it's a gel, but it's a powder too. It's really weird. Um, it just feels really nice. So I used this with my Revlon um, Brow Fantasy Pencil. So I fill it in and then I use this. And then I finish the rest of my makeup and I like kind of dry. Then I brush it out with my mascara, not my mascara, my brow brush thing and then I put the gel that comes in the brow fantasy on top just kind of make sure everything's locked into place I did get the wrong color of this and got blondie brows instead of like a brown but it actually matches pretty well that is the swatch right there so it kind of matches that but it's right there okay so once again it is time for the music favorites and as always I have a Spotify playlist on my Spotify, so if you guys don't know, I have a Spotify. All my links for social media, shut up. All my links for social media and information is down below. So this is my, this is my July favorite playlist. Um, I have some plain white tees. I don't know what it was, but I just found the plain white tees again, and I fell in love with them. So they're on here. A lot of old music's on here, like All American Rejects. Um, I have some Pitbull. Trey the Pooh, 21 Pilots, Selena Gomez, obviously, you can't have a favorite playlist without Selena Gomez. Um, the soundtrack for Ghostbusters came out, and the uh, Five Seconds Summer has a song um, called Girls Like Talk, Girls Like Boys, Girls Talk Boys. If you haven't heard it, go go listen to it, go watch the video. I'll actually link the video down below because it's a really funny video. Um, yeah, so I just have some Selena Gomez, Hey It's Time Bell. Um, Charlie Puth, All Making Rejects, Five Seconds of Summer, did I say them? Playing White Tees, and Ariana Grande. So you guys want to see what I listen to every month for my monthly favorites. Um, I make a new playlist at the beginning of every month, so I actually have an August playlist that I've been listening to like crazy. Um, at the beginning of every month, I make a playlist, and I add to it. Um, I don't really take things away because I don't like taking music off my playlist because I, I did like that that month. But if you guys want to see what else I've been listening to, I have a day-to-day -day playlist which is 60 songs that I listen to all the time so it's like compiled of all my monthly favorites um, and I do update that quite frequently. Um, but then I also have like all my other playlists like January, February, March, April, May, June, July and I have an August one right now because it's August. So you guys want to go check out all my playlists, all my links will be down below for Spotify and everything else. Oh, my battery is dying, so I'm going to finish this up real quick. Um, my last couple favorites are one, sleep, because I love sleep. I've been taking so many naps this summer because I have an 8 a.m. class every day. Um, so yes, I've been taking naps like crazy. And another one is Snapchat. I actually love the filters right now because they're just so funny. So if you guys don't follow me on Snapchat, 
those will be linked down below also along with all my other social media I'm gonna hurry up and get off because my camera is gonna die if you like this video give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below also don't forget to subscribe because I make new videos every Saturday ish gonna try to get back at that and yeah that's it I'll see you all later bye